Hello everyone, I am B. Monisha, working as Assistant Professor in Department of Physics, KSR College of Arts and Science for Women, Thirichangudu. Today, we are going to see about the topic is photoelectric effort. Before going to this topic, we have to know what is photon. Photon, in 1905, uh, Einstein proposed that electromagnetic radiation or light is made up of photons. Thus, the photon is the elementary element of light or light is made up of photons. Einstein showed that light energy is not emitted continuously, but it is emitted by individual amount of energy. It is called quantum of energy. Then, energy of photon. According to Einstein, each photon of light wave of frequency has the energy. E is given by E is equal to H nu, where E is energy of photon. Uh, its SI unit is joule. H is Planck constant. Then nu is a frequency of photon. Its SI unit is H. Then properties of photon. A photon does not have any mass and the photon does not have any change and are not deflected in electric field and magnetic field. All the quantum numbers are zero for a photon. In empty space, the photon moves at speed of light. In the interactions of radiation with matter, radiation behaves as if it is made up of particles, is called photons. Then the energy and momentum of a photon are related as follows capital E is equal to P dot C where P is the magnitude and momentum and C is the speed of light. Then a photon is called as a virtual particles and the energy of photon is directly proportional to the frequency and inversely proportional to the uh, wavelength. Then photoelectric effect. When a beam of light of sufficiently high frequency onto a clean metal surface, then the light will cause electrons to leave the surface. The phenomenon of electrons by the metals when they are exposed to light of suitable frequency is called as the photoelectric effect and emitted electrons is called as photoelectrons. Construction of the photoelectric effect, the Hitz experimental setup used for studying the photoelectric effect is shown in the figure. The setup consists of an evacuated glass tube that has a photosensitive metal plate C and another metal plate A. A monochromatic light source emerging from the source S yes, of sufficiently short wavelength enters the glass window W and fall on photosensitive plate C is called emitter. Then working uh, a photoelectric effect is when a beam of light fall on photosensitive metal plate C which is called emitter. The plate C emits photoelectrons due to photoelectric effect. The photoelectrons emitted by photo plate C will be attracted towards the positive plate A. These electrons uh, flows in the eternal circuit to cause an electric current in the whole circuit. Such a current is known as the photoelectric current and measured by the micrometer connected in the circuit. Thank you.